All right, let's look at the second example we have. So second example right here, we have A and B both negative. When we substitute, we have to very be careful because we're going to have a lot of parentheses come out. So let's just first substitute out the numbers we have. So A is negative 2. So we're going to write negative 2 to the third. Multiply negative 4. Whenever it's negative, we get parentheses. The second term we have plus negative 2 squared times negative 4. The last one we have will be negative 3 times negative 2 times negative 4. So we're starting for exponents. So let's start in from negative 2 to the third first, right here. So we have parentheses. The 3 is for the negative 2. So what do we have will be negative 2 times negative 2 times negative 2. So negative 2 times negative 2 give you a positive 4. Then times the third negative 2 will be a negative 8. So we're going to have negative 8. This is starting, so I don't have to give the parentheses. That's going to be negative 8 times negative 4. So I'm going to do negative 2 square. I do have a negative 2 square right here, which is positive 4. So the basic I have will be plus 4. I'll multiply negative 4. I'm just going to copy the rest. Next, we're going to do a multiplication here. Since we don't have a division, we're going to do from left to right. So let's start from here. We have a negative times a negative, which gives you a positive. 8 times 4, that's going to be 32. The next one we have is positive 4 times negative 4. We're going to use the sign. We're going to use negative positive 4, then times a negative 4. So result is negative, because a positive times a negative is negative. We're going to write it down negative right here. So 4 times 4 is 16. The last one, we're going to do one by one, negative 3 times negative 2. We're going to use negative sign. So that's negative, two, negative 3 times negative 2. Negative times negative is positive. 3 times 2, 6. Then times negative 4. Let's finish the multiplication here. I just copied 32 minus 16. So a positive 6 times negative 4. A positive times a negative is negative. 6 times 4, 24. Okay. Now we have subtraction only. So starting from left to right, we're going to do 32 subtract 16. We give me 16. Subtract 24. 16 is smaller than 24. We don't have enough. Result will be negative. So. 24 minus 16 is 8, negative 8. That's going to be our final answer. Thank you.